Hello and welcome. I am Harish, and in this channel, I talk about how you can build anything without coding. And this video is about five tools that you can use to create engaging forms and get responses from your customers. Without further ado, let's quickly jump into the video and see what these five tools are. Great. So the first tool I have for you is JotForm.com. JotForm.com lets you create forms without coding, and actually more than forms, if I were to be honest. And uh, you can link these forms to either Google Sheets or Airtable or any other CRM that you have using Zapier, and do a bunch of automations. And let's quickly look at what are all the features that are available in JotForm, right? Just for the forms component itself, they have a bunch of different tools, which is translate forms, assign forms, enable disable form. These are all different features that are available. They have signed forms where people can sign uh, their digital signatures, basically. Uh, you can also create mobile applications using dot forms. Let's quickly see one of those. Yeah, you can convert your PDF into HTML web forms. If there is a PDF that you have where there, there is a form embedded into the PDF, you can always upload it here and convert it into a HTML page. That is also possible in uh, dot form. JotForm is probably one of the best tools in the market that has a suite of features that lets you do more than just forms and you can always embed these forms wherever you want and these are all the types of features uh, and the options that are available where you can add an image slider into the form, you can add multiple text fields, you can add a dynamic text field where you are grabbing information based on users uh, input in other page of the form, you can create multi-page forms, you can add terms and conditions, you can embed a YouTube video, you can let the people select, uh, let your users select multiple options from one drop down, you can always show a checklist, a uh, bunch of features and all these are widgets that are available, you can convert a spreadsheet into a form where all the columns are converted into form fields, you don't have to worry about creating the form entirely from uh, scratch, you can collect users uh, location of course with their consent but yes that's also possible these are all the widgets that are available as part of creating being able to create forms using jot form and obviously they have a bunch of templates that you can also leverage which is product order form if you don't have the time or the money that requires for you to create an e-commerce store you can always explore jot form to be able to create a product order form and let your customers order using jot form itself there are many other examples and templates that are available on jotform.com do check it out and the second tool that I have is Typeform, the other most popular form creating tool that many use, many startups actually use. They have a free plan you can start off with free, right? As you can see, there is a free plan you can always sign up for free and use the tool and understand what it has to offer. But they also have a paid plan and a lot of integrations are by default available. You can always send your Typeform data into Airtable or Google Sheets or just link it to Zapier and send it to any CRM, custom CRM that you use or just send automated emails from Zapier itself using these integrations and they also have a lot of templates that you can just quickly check out and leverage. Typeform has this unique form filling experience of just one field they show at, at a time and you can scroll down and it's a very intuitive experience where you once the user enters, then they can scroll down to the other fields that are available. And this is one of the templates that they have. You can also get payments from your customers right from the fields itself. So that is the second tool that I have, which is Typeform. Now, hopping on to Tally.so, which is my third tool and my favorite tool to create forms, which has a very generous free plan. Let's quickly jump into Tally.so. And I call this my favorite tool because I created an entire course of about eight episodes of what all you can do with tally.so right and here is my dashboard uh, i'm logged into the account so you can see the dashboard but let me quickly show you one form that i created using tally.so you can embed these forms anywhere this is more like a notion experience and this is an example of how to create an e-commerce store using uh, tally.so it's a simple store you can list your products here go to payment and then it will calculate the total and use stripe as the payment gateway and collect payments, right? But tally.so, uh, let's quickly jump into seeing the templates they have. They also, just like any other form builder, have a lot of templates that you can quickly use directly without having to create any of these. Because most forms are most likely common, like contact us form or 
uh, hiring form or a booking template or simple calculator or uh, order form that I just showed you, you can also use my uh, template that is also available on this platform should be here somewhere but yes I mean these are all the templates that are let's see the pricing and uh, the model of pricing and how they charge right so yeah if you don't want tally, tally branding or if you want to collaborate with your internal team to be able to create forms multiple forms at the same time and if you want unlimited uploads or any of these specific options that you see on the screen right now those are all pro features right pro starts at $29 a month or two ninety a year uh, but the free plan covers pretty much anything you can create unlimited forms and submissions your users will not care about uh, the small branding that the tool has uh, as long as what you offer to them is much more valuable and you can always integrate webhooks without any limits right you can send your data to Airtable without having to pay so tally.so should be your go-to if you're creating very uh, intuitive interactive forms and as a creator also it is very easy to create forms on tally.so if you uh, already have experience of using Notion every day. It's more or less similar experience of building forms uh, when you use Tally.so. And my fourth tool is Typebot.io, another tool that I've been recently exploring quite a lot. This tool lets you convert all the mundane forms with different fields into much more interactive elements like a chatbot, right? As you can see, this form on the left is actually converted to this on the right, right? You have buttons for interaction. You can send this data through webhooks too. Any platform that you have, you can integrate multiple APIs. I've made a lot of videos on typebot.io. Do check them out from the description below or on the iCard above. But yes, this tool lets you convert your forms into interactive forms, right? You can add GIFs, you can add uh, buttons, you can add uh, custom integrations with uh, external APIs if you want to build like a quiz bot or something like that. But yes, they have a pricing model. They don't have a generous free plan like uh, others but yes they have a simple free plan you can create unlimited type bots experience what are all the features that are available and then also decide if you want to pay right this tool is also open source you can uh, if you are a developer you can actually uh, leverage their tool and host it on your own but the there are definitely limits for that as well but yes that option is also available if you are a technical person and my fifth tool and the last tool for this video is crypto.com slash studio Yep, that's the last tool that I have for you, which is Tributor.com. Let's see what they have as part of the tool. Uh, these are also, they also let you create automations, also forms. Uh, they let you store data with all the compliances in place and also very easy to publish the form as well. Make sure you check it out. And the, the order of these tools in, is in no particular order. I just randomly place these tools because my favorite out of all of them is actually Tally.so but all the others are also great and amazing tools. As you can see, this is how Tripodon looks like and uh, yes, very similar experience to creating a more interactive form but let's quickly see what their pricing model is. Yeah, these are all the options that are available uh, in their features list. Start for free and they have pricing which is, yeah, they have a free plan, again, excellent amazing free plan with uh, very generous offerings like you can create unlimited forms you can create unlimited logics and questions jump uh, to different question if the user has a different response to the answer let's say a user picked a you can sh show a different path to the user all those are possible here in the future you'll see uh, me creating forms on this tool but this is also a great tool that you can create forms with and also automations right all the tools that i've shown today help you create automations as well where you can send emails to people who are filling these forms or you can store them in specific email subscriber list and send them different emails if they're subscribing to you uh, or any other automation that you think you should probably do uh, depending on your specific use case. But yes, please note that not all of them are free or have a free plan. And uh, yeah, most of them have a free plan, but uh, it's up to you to choose depending on your specific use case to which tool uh, suits you the best. If you've learned something, drop a like below and consider subscribing. This channel is all about building without coding. And I will see you in another one. Peace.